In this video, we will cover the reporting feature. We allow administrators to create reports based on usage. To accomplish this, find your way to the Reports tab on the top portion of the dashboard. Currently, we don't have any reports configured, but let's go through the process of creating one. Click Create Report. Give your report a title. Choose which organization you would like this report to be for. And keep in mind, when you're clicked on your parent organization, it will create the report for all the organizations underneath it. You can choose a date range. Select what you want this report to cover. In this case, we're going to select all. Type any notes you need to. And then you could just add names or email addresses of who you would like to send this report to. You can have this report recur on a schedule. Put how often you would like it to repeat, when you would like to start this report, and when you would like to end this report. Once you click Save, it will bring a pop-up message up, would you like to send a copy of this report to the recipients immediately? Just click OK and your report will be created. You'll then be redirected to the Reports tab. You'll see your new report created. There's two ways you can view your report. You can either click the name, which will generate the HTML version, or you can download the PDF version by clicking Download PDF on the right. You're also allowed to edit this report or delete this report. We have three tabs. You can either look at all of your reports, your saved reports, or your scheduled reports. This concludes the reporting video.